Hello chess lovers, Surin here and in this video we are going to witness another battle. Believe it or not, but today I have a visitor from the past. This is Kasper of Sizes Turbo 16K produced in 1985. Let's see whether this beast can show resistance against me. Well, but before starting our game, in case you're interested in technical specifications of this computer, you can visit SpaciousMind.com and read everything you need to know about this computer. As mentioned above, the computer was produced in 1985. At that time it cost $195 and when it comes to the playing strength, the computer is not a strong one. The maximum strength is 1850 and yes, I think that I can easily beat this guy. As mentioned above, for more details please check out this website which contains a lot of useful and interesting information. By the way, when it comes to my computer clocks they are not working. Actually the computer also had some problems. For a long time I was not managing to turn that on, even unscrewed. Looks like that I even managed to somewhat fix the computer and now we can go for our game. Let's go for it and see what will happen on the board. I'm playing with white pieces and I will start with E4. Let's see what's going to be the computer's response. It's showing that 7 franc E7 to e6 french defense wow french defense right let's go for d2 to d4 d7 d7 to d5 yes let's go for knight c3 and let's see what are you going to do sir bishop from f8 to b4 wow the computer goes for whenever variation. Not bad, not bad, my dear friend. Can I readjust my camera? Yes, I think that from this angle it's better. Let's go to E2, to E4, to E5. And what is the computer? 7 franc from C7 to C5. Not bad, not bad, my dear friend. I will play bishop d2 this is a very creepy move and if black doesn't know the opening then can face serious problems it says c5 to d4 right and now i will go for this devastating knight b5 move i'm offering the exchange of dark squared bishops bishop from b4 to d2 not the best continuation Usually Belek is keeping alive his dark squared bishop and is moving it back on e7 from where it can control the d6 square but now I can recapture with my queen and sir you are in trouble I'm threatening knight d6 check it's showing knight from b8 to c6 yes and now actually I can go for that check or Maybe I should first play a move like f4. I can always go for the check, right? Let's go from f2 to f4. Although knight f3 was also a strong move. And what is the engine playing? d8 to a5. Wow. Wow, sir. What? This is a terrible mistake, guys. I can remove his queen. No, 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 no. Something I misunderstood. What was the engine's move? D. What was the engine's move? Did it play from D8 to A5? Hmm. Ah, uh, okay, it shows this pawn, right? Ah, uh, it shows the four frame. No, 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 no. What's happening, guys? What's happening? I can't understand. What was the move which the... A ah, sorry, the H... H1 square? 
What is? No. Ah, sorry. It played from D8 to H4. Holy God. Holy God. What is this? It announced the check, right? Okay, okay. Everything is okay. I just misunderstood. Yes, I just misunderstood. And now... Queen, move back your queen. Where? To E7? That was actually a terrible move. Why would someone play a move like Queen H4 check? Should I go for that? And now this queen is hindering the development of the knight. Let's simply go for go for what? Let's go for knight f3. Although I can also castle queen side, but let's go for knight f3. Make a move, sir. It says g8 to h6, right? Okay, this one is not a bad one. Already I should announce that check in order not to allow my opponent to castle. And now the engine, the computer will play king from d8 to f8. I don't like your position, sir. I don't like your position and I think that you are in trouble. Yes, you are in trouble. So now I can munch this guy on d4. It recaptured with his knight and I will recapture with my queen. So what's going to be your answer, sir? Queen to c7. Hmm. And now, aren't there any hidden tactics? Move like queen before, but he will capture. He will capture. No, he can't capture. I will capture on c8. But I can go for this simple castling queen side. Yes. Let's go for this daring move. Although this can allow him gain some counter attack on the queen side, but I will go for it. And the engine says. No, 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 no. Ah, okay. I haven't inserted the move correctly. And now, again, the computer is moving his queen. Where are you moving? To a5? Wow. It's not a good idea to move your queen all the time. Sir, haven't you learned that in school? You should have learned that. And... Okay, what? A6? No, no, no. Knight to G4. Knight to G4. Well, what is this knight doing on G4? Let's kick it away. Let's kick it away. Let's kick it away. Yes. The computer is playing terribly. And now again we have it. Now I can go for G4. Yes, this is a total destruction, guys. What are you going to play? Rook? No, no, no. King? To G8? Yes, this chicken king is escaping. The chicken king is escaping. And now I can go for another devastating move. What is going to be my next move? Let's g5. g5 is also a good move. After knight f5 and the exchange of knights, I can win the pawn on d5, but... But we are not pawn grabbers. Let's develop my bishop as well. Let's develop my bishop as well. Then, then I will show you how strong I am. What are you playing? Queen? No, 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 the rook, b8, the rook to b8, right? Hmm, a miserable, miserable move. What about a move like f5? f5 is simply a... Shall I go for it? Yes, yes. I won't lose my precious time and... Bishop? 
here. Wow. Bishop to here, right? Not bad, not bad, sir. What shall I gain by playing f6? Not too much. Not too much. Well, maybe a move like rook f1 can be can be very nice. A queen to a4. Yes. Our friend is offering an exchange of queens, but sir, <laughs> what are you doing? Don't you know that I won't accept your offer? I think that this is a nice square. Although queen c5 was also a good one, you know. Queen c5 followed by queen c7. Again, he's moving back on a5. If I play queen d4, will he repeat the moves? I don't know, but we can give a try. Although we should look for better moves. A move like queen g5 can be very useful. I don't know what am I doing, but I just want to crush my opponent, guys. f6 is the threat, come on. a4? Oh, b4. So, so what are you going to do if I play f6? Sir, if I play f6, what are you going to do? Yes, sir. You are lost. Your position is lost after f6. What? G? Okay, I will munch your knight. It's over, guys. It's over. This is a total destruction. Queen to b2. Wow, desperate. Yes, the computer is prolonging his resistance. I simply demolished that beast. And now, bishop to c6, right. Shall we announce the checkmate? Yes, guys, let's go for it. Let's go for it and kill the beast. Queen g7, and this is a checkmate. Look at this. Look at this, guys. Yes. Not a strong one, but it's a lot of fun, you know? It's a lot of fun to play against this monster. And I hope that you enjoyed this game greatly. Well, thanks for watching, dear chess lovers. If you liked this game, give the thumbs up. Also, share this video with your friends. Let them know about this vintage chess computer and my game against it. I will see you in my next video. Good luck.